Hello, hello, and welcome back to Caves of Cud with Veru. It's me, Veru. Yeah, I mean, you probably got that. Let's jump in and see what we're going to build today. Today, I feel like doing a high intelligence build. I'm going to go up to 20 starting intelligence. We're going to do another agility build because I'm... I think they're really quite powerful, like stupidly powerful, really. Um, maybe not go all the way up. Oh, maybe, though... Go up to 18, 16, 2. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna. Oh, hard choices. I want my ego so low I can't buy anything ever. Um, that looks pretty good to me. Gives me some decent starting options. Let's take a look. Uh, I'm not gonna do any of that. I mean, the unstable genome gives you a decent chance to get uh, a higher level thing for less. But since I'm not going Esper, and I don't want to only have the access to uh, physical stuff. In fact, I'm not even sure why Chimera is there. Like, unless you're running a super low ego build, why wouldn't you want to have access to them? Um, this is where it gets more interesting. So... I'm kind of curious about the Confusing Venom, but I think the Paralyzing Venom's probably better overall. Uh, night Vision, because why wouldn't I want to uh, be able to use both of my hands without have to worry about torches or glowing things that fly. Now, ooh, hard choices ahead. I'm thinking about going with Freezing Hands. I haven't done Freezing Hands yet. And I'm getting the feeling it's probably pretty amazing. But I'm going to need some kind of armor, I think. Well, I don't, actually. I could go freezing hands. That being said, if I'm going agi, I'm talking about using short swords. So I've got my damage covered. I'm really thinking protection. In which case, do I go quills? Have an early bit of damage. Or... Care no, because that minus dodge is... We're horrible. It's horrible. So we are going to go for quills for my armor because I'd like the defensiveness of it is, is just really good. And I'm going to go phasing. There's a lot of good things you can do with phasing. Uh, it's a great defensive thing, but mostly I'm going to use it to steal things and get into places I shouldn't be able to get. And I enjoy doing that. It's fun. So let's look. Um, I don't care about that. Let's face it. It's going to be Scholar or Tinker. And in this particular case, I suppose it could be Arcanaut. It could be Arcanaut. Arcanaut, they get the, sh the short blade and the spry dodge right away. And the agility, yeah, we're going to go Arcanaut. I think I've already built this guy exactly like this before, but we're going to do it anyway. I'm not going to save him. My name is Veru, and I like your mama. Dirt, 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 dirt. Yeah, oh, I was going to read that, but... Okie doke. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I want to open it. That's why I said... Oh, ooh. Dagger. Iron short sword. <laughs> okay. Let's get that in my right hand, eh? And... Take a look at that. We got a Sultan history. I'll, I'll, I'll let you read it. In early 193, Yapater II challenged the le 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 legitimacy of the Sultan of Cud over the sanctioned persecution of a dot. She won and proclaimed herself Sultan. She was 88 years old. I hope that's not a precursor of major failings to come that the sustained persecution of no one at all we're going to find out. If it fails, it fails. I've got a painted short bow. What's that about? In 433, Ororahim Oro III had her legitimacy challenged by an aspirant over the rights of fungi. She won and had the pretender buried deep under the earth. She was 44 years old. It makes you realize what a simple life you've lived. I've never had anyone buried alive or up to their neck or anything like that. I feel like I'm really 
I'm behind. I'm behind in life, basically. Uh, yeah, let's go in there. Arrows, armor that I'm immediately going to sell. Yay. Okie doke. Yeah, pretty sure. <gasps> Artifacts. And they're only one pound, which means they are both grenades. And I'm going to try and identify them anyway, in case. Thermal grenade. And poison grenade. Looks like I'm going to get that quest done fast. Okay. Can't wear that, can't wear that, can't wear that. Can wear that, can't wear that, can't wear that. Don't need any of these. Don't need any of this stuff. Need all of that. Need a... Ooh. I started with salve injectors? Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Fine by me. I'm not going to complain. Let's get all your vine wafers. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Plus one agility gloves early on. I think I might have to have those. Yeah. Goodbye, copper nuggets. I'm going to have to give him some of my water, aren't I? Um, or, or, 420, blaze for life. Yeah, I know. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, probably. I'm just going to have to give him some of my stuff. It's got a desert rifle and a compound bow, too. This dude's like far more set up than he usually is. But let's uh, let's give him some water. Yeah, take my water, punk. Hey, kitty. So right before I uh, recorded this episode, I sort of started recording another episode using the chest hole tile set available in the workshop on Steam. And honestly, I was okay with it. Um, it's not, I don't like it as much as I like the chest hole Cataclysm tile set, which is the default one that I use in all my games. But what broke it for me was that, unfortunately, it wasn't set up so that when you... Oh, I want to be really careful here. I don't want to get rid of my good injectors, you know, my crappy grenades. It wasn't set up so... Good to sneeze. <sighs> so that when you hit Alt, you get the either red or green highlight on the basis of whether or not guys are your enemies or not. And to me, that's just too important. Okay, yeah. I'll be your I'll be your apprentice, but before we do that, let's get my quills upgraded. Quills upgraded, and let's get some skills. I don't want to deal with food woes, but actually, I don't have the weight early on to deal with all that extra meat, so I want to save up for that jab. Okay, that's all done. Let's pop over to the rest wells. Where there's a decent chance that I'll get everything I need before I even have to go downstairs. Uh, why you guys want to be my enemies? Don't you realize how valuable I am as a friend? Because then you're still alive. Snap jaws, gotta die. I will take that, I will take that. And by that I mean some shoes. Oh, I've already got shoes and a bronze short sword, which I will immediately, it's the exact same. I'll keep the nice pretty thing. Okay. Ooh, chest. Uh, more stuff I don't really need. Stop throwing at things with a goat, dude. These goats are my friends. Y'all dead. Ooh, they're not friends of hermits though. You gonna kill that hermit? Who's going to who's going to get through this? Probably the goat. If you kill him, I can take his stuff. So Oh, he didn't drop anything. Insult to injury. Um, yeah. Ooh, honey. Nice. That might come in later when I'm looking to construct cures for diseases I don't currently have. That's right. Go get killed by a, a jilted lover. And you, sir, are not going to rest my equipment. Oh, and then I walk right into one. 
Give me your stems. Okay, we're gonna sting you and paralyze you, and then we're gonna slice open all your tendons and let you bleed out. Like the jerk that you are. Sting in 15 turns. You wanna go on a merry race? Let's race. Sting in six rounds. And sting you, and then slice you, then kill you. Good. Nothing interesting around. I'm looking for a bit of wire. Hey, get out of my area. We'll take your copper though. We still friends? Yeah, we're still friends. And I'm mad good at dodging. So if you look at my uh, DV up here, merp, 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 that's 11. That's really good. It means most of the time these dudes aren't hitting me, which is what I want because being hit sucks. You my friend? You're my friend, so I protect you. Whoa, there has been a baboon bloodbath over here. Who killed all these baboons? I want to give them a, I want to send them like a thank you letter or something. Okay, bloody leech, you're dead. Oh, there we go. There's some wire. Is there water here? I could have sworn I just stepped in the water and it splashed everywhere. Oh, it must have been trash. Like right over here. Some trash. Yay, nothing. More trash. Not a thing. Kadok. And have we basically looked at everything? Yeah, basically. Maybe not every single thing, but good enough. Let's head down. I still need quite a bit of wire. You coming? You suck. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Let's not get... Oh, crap. Okay, let's, uh, let's quill fling you then, eh? You guys gonna let me rest? Good. <sighs> Quill fling is good. Yeah, kill the hermit. No, oh, I want his water skins and stuff. I mean, I like you, hermit dude. I don't want to kill you. You're fine. But you got such tasty gear, and I don't want to upset you. I don't want to, like, actually. I don't know. I should probably check. If you kill dudes, does it actually affect your long term faction standing, or is it. Hey, I got a level. Let's see what we can do with that. Attribute points. So let's take a look at skills for a second. I am not going to need 25 agility for a long time. Did I ever put on my gloves? So I, I can get the agility quite a bit later, basically, is what I'm saying. Um, Having said, rejoinder is really good, like really good. And if I'm going to bother getting it, that being said, uh, if I'm just trying to get plus agility, I think I can get that on some items. So it might worth be worth waiting for that. And what am I at intelligence wise? 20. I'm not going to need 21 intelligence for a while. I'm going to want 23 eventually because this dude's a scholar. He's, he's very smart, like smarter than you. So, hmm. Uh, more importantly, though, ooh, I could save up and I could get rejoinder stupidly early. And no, I kind of want. Hmm. This doubles the likelihood of an offhand attack. But this almost doubles the amount of attacks I get, assuming ever I dodge all the time, which isn't actually a safe assumption. Um, that's good extra damage. 
Getting an automatic penetration is pretty good. Hard choices. Eventually I'm going to want to probably pump some points into dual wield. It's a little bit better if you've got a, the mutated arms ability, but... Yeah. Um, and I also need to get Juke, simply because so many of my abilities play off of Juke, like uh, my Tumble gives me better Juke. I might go... F I can't get Tumble into... I want that extra dodge. Oh, man. Hmm. Whenever you Juke an opponent on a willing short blade, you make free attack if you have Blood Letter. Okay, then I'll always cause bleeding when Juking. Hobble. Oh. So I'm, I know I'm not going to need it for a while, but I'm actually going to go with the intelligence partially because I want the extra skill points that it's going to give me. It doesn't give them to me right now, but it, I guess it might only give them to me when I get up to 22 intelligence. We'll see. Anyway, let's... Can I take another Quills? No. We'll go Stinger. And then let's do some skills. I'm going to go with Jab. Just because it's, it's a good early thing to have. Dun, dun, dun. And as it is, these guys just don't last long. Can I get the water skin with honey? So much honey. Oh, wait, dude. What are you doing? That's why I'm here. That's the auto explore function being derpy. It doesn't know why I'm here. How could it? Oh, nice. Okay, 129. It's not bad. How much will I be able to get on the first floor? Is the question. Okay, dude. Uh, well, looks like that's it. Yep. So, can we go downstairs? Pour from four. You got slapped. I'll take that iron dagger. I will take the arrows. And I'll take the bronze dagger too. It's light. So, let's switch out that bronze dagger. With an iron dagger. Throwing weapon, right arm, nothing, head, nothing. I need to keep an eye out for a. Huh, that'll do. Forehead item. Ha 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 ha. Very nice. Take those gloves. Oh no, I've got gloves. Oh, I'll take them anyway. They're pretty light. And they might sell alright. One of these days I need to actually like make myself a little spreadsheet about uh, innate values of things. Take that, take a look. In early 432, Or Ororahim III was assailed by a pretender over an ordinance mandating the practice of water fasting. She won and had the aspirant exiled. She sounds like a mean lady. Like, I mean, you had a, you had an argument. There's no need to, like, exile someone over an argument. Is there? Is there? Can't we all just, you know, have a conversation first? Does it always have to go immediately to exile or being buried up to your neck? Did it just rust? Well, at least I know that'll be worth it. Uh, let's sting you. If you're, are you paralyzed? No, but you miss me like all the time. Oh, baby, why do you miss me all the time? I mean, I don't mind. I think it's sweet. Oh, yeah, I want to, I want to just, no, it's crap. There is the down staircase. Oh, you need to leave me alone. 
problem, crab dude. Okay. You are a candidate. Okay, this is a problem. Uh, man, this is a problem. Uh, we're gonna phase. And then we're going down. Okay, that did not work. What are these things? Web toad spark ticks. I've never seen these things before. They're mean. I don't like them. Go away. I do not want to use the salve injector yet. Can you please just not? Okay, that's good. Oh, that's bad. Can you be paralyzed? Okay, I'm going to just quill you to death. Oh, that was scurry. That was scary. Can I heal up? Let's, oh, wow, why is everybody all green? Web toad, what's with all these web toad dudes? I've never seen them before. Okay, healed up. Good to go. Let's go back upstairs. I never finished. I never found if there was any more stuff up here that I wanted. Okay. Maybe you don't kill me. Thank goodness for uh, that stinger, man. Without that stinger, I would be dead a few times by now. So, I'm really glad that my mom clearly had sex with a wasp, is what I'm saying. Let's see where we can go from here. Um, yep, kill the ooze. Which in my head is now killed a wabbit. Okay, how are we doing? We're still alive. We're at full health. Come on. And I'm up another level. Wow, those guys give uh, good points. But other generally, you know, poor quality loot. I'll take that iron mace. Can't wear Burnus. So I've got two mutation points because I uh, just didn't level up last time. Uh, can I can I do this one again? No. Stinger it is. Okay, and let's look at skills. So ooh, I could hobble, I could bloodletter, but I've got enough now to juke. And I feel like that could be a don't die specialty of mine, you know, getting out of a bad situation by juking. So, you coming? Okay. I'll take all of that. Uh, iron longsword, yes, please. Okay, so. Oh, narrow avoid, narrowly avoided bleeding out on a stupid young ivory. Those dudes suck. Ooh, shotgun! Uh, can we identify it, please? Please give me luck. Give me luck. Pump shotgun. Nice. So, not really uses this thing very much anyway. I would rather use it in a pinch because some guy's close to me that I want to die immediately. Brackish slime. 
I'm what is over here? There we go. Uh, see, that's what I'm talking about with the whole uh, thing. I mean, it didn't really save me any time, realistically. Okay, that guy should be dead, right? I swear I just killed him. Does he, does he jump around or something? Why did I not get any money for killing that dude? No, I don't want to store anything. Dude, you gotta not do that. That's my stuff. Don't rust my stuff, you stupid kudzu, whatever you're pronounced as. And then again, and then again, and then again, and then again, and then you're dead. Uh, okay, quilted shawl, I'll get it. I'm heading back to town now anyway, so I might as well fill up on stuff assuming I've got the space how am I doing 171 or 240 okay oh, just take the tuber okay so now basically anything that's reasonably okay can come with me and tell them up to my uh, limit actually there's still a place I can go down let's go down more yes oh yes a hundred times yes what is this a chain pistol I don't even know what that is but that sounds amazing we're getting all of this what am I at 187 of 240. How did I I'll take that? I guess I don't need it, but ring mail. This, this is the what's going on? This place is also incredibly open, which is weird. And people are on fire and stuff. What's that about? We'll take a look at that engraved bronze longsword. On the anniversary of a great battle, a cook found a babe with a salt-spangled brine in each hand. That doesn't make any sense. It's not a, that's not a countable noun. Outside her tavern, she and her fellow cooks adopted the babe and named her Oro, Oro Rahim the Third. Oh, good to know. I'm going to take that. Maybe it'll sell. What are we looking at? More dudes to kill, more dudes to kill. Oh, take that willowy thing, because that won't take much space. Okay, so this is a strangely open space. Uh, I shouldn't keep picking up the wire, though, because honestly, if I remember correctly, when you turn in the quest, you just get all of the wire taken. So just drop down to exactly 200. Save a little bit of space. Now, usually, I think almost every other time I've done this, when you get down to a certain point, it's just there's nothing else there. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, yeah. Acting against the prohibition on the practice of wank. I was about to say wanking without purpose. <laughs> Wandering without purpose, Oro Rahim II led an army to the gates of Hakesh. He sacked Hakesh and persecuted its citizens, forcing them to change its name to Oro Rahim City. Dude sounds like a total dick. I'm just going to shotgun you for fun. And take your bow. Yeah, bronze ingot. What's this? A forge. If this were a different kind of game, I think maybe I could use it to do something. But this thing's still early access. Maybe later.
Just killing dudes who need to be killed. Such is life. Okay, that dude right there is called a slumberling. And if you wake him up, you die, basically, is the principle there. So I'm going to run away now and go back home. Is this up? That's stairs down. We're going home. I want to turn in this quest. I might come back here. Because honestly, this is not a bad leveling ground. Did I actually finish clearing out all the stuff I can... Ah! Nuh -uh -uh. No, it's kind of crap. Okay, let's go up. Okay, come on, just kill that dang mood. Slime. Let's go home. Okay. Let's go turn this thing in. And then we'll go do the other quest. Or possibly we'll stop and I'll stop the recording. Take the wire. Nice, level six. I've got a recoiler with no cell because he's a cheap bastard and won't give me a proper... Like, why? Why are you going to give me a cell? Why are you going to give me a thing that requires a cell but not give me a cell? Portable wall... What is that? Contrarians still puzzle over their meaning. Most of Cud's prominent linguist cults have converged on a single interpretation for when both nature and architects have failed you. <laughs> Cute. Okay, some data disks. I'm going to want to buy a bunch of these. Ooh, can I just read this without... No, that would have been too good. Uh, let's go sell a bunch of crap. Don't need these, 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 or these, or these, that. Yes, I know I'm doing these and that, but it's just stuff I don't need, so. Honestly, all the stuff I don't need is just classified under the heading of other stuff I don't need. And I think that's, uh... It's mostly just, yeah, weapon, steel utility knife I'm keeping. Uh, I can probably sell the engraved iron short sword. I want these shotgun shells. I'll take all your copper, because I'm going to sell you even more stuff. I'm not getting rid of that chain pistol. That is probably actually going to replace the uh, probably need to get all of your lead slugs because that chain pistol is probably amazing I've never used one so I can't be sure uh, can you fix that? no uh, 51 bronze ingot You're heavy. At 10, you're just not as good as copper nuggets. Um, wouldn't mind getting a bit more water from you, so I guess that'll do. Uh, yeah, fine. Okay, doke. I still have more stuff than I can functionally deal with. One thing I need to do is I need to go grab a chest and set myself up a little uh, room here in Joppa. One thing I haven't checked is... Oh, you're only hated by unshelled reptiles? Well, then by all means, let's share water. Yeah, heck yeah. Um, that's good enough. Who hates you? Nobody hates you. You're my best friend. Let's share water. Yep. And who hates you? Oh, wait. <clears throat> A 
flock of the Hakish's wife and the consortium of Phyta. I don't really necessarily want to piss off the consortium of Phyta. I can get around that by sharing secrets. You don't actually want secrets. He wants secrets, though. Um, you have a secret. Um, I'll tell you about the bur the raising of Ororachim. And you're going to teach me harvestry. Nice. And I'm going to harvest like a madman. Okay. Way too much crap. And I gotta go head to the next place. So, you gonna buy some of my crap, please? I would like it. 3.9 drams. Oh, everything you sell is so expensive. I swear it's gotten more expensive since I looked last time. I suppose I could be wrong. But I don't think I am. Um, said pretty much everybody all the time. So 3.9, 4.2 would be fine. Take that. Good. Uh, I need to get a... Okay, well, let's just go. Wow, there's like nobody here. Usually there's a bunch of baboons throwing rocks at me. So good day to be me, I guess. Have I leveled up? No, I've got 332 skill points. Uh, let's go quills. I get that three AV now, which is n not a bad thing. Skills. Now here's the point at which I, I just happen to have saved enough. I could go dual wield. I get flurry, I get offhand strikes. And if it's doubling my chance to hit with the offhand strike with the other one, as long as it's a short blade, then technically this offhand strike's ability is increasing my chance to hit to 70%, to use my offhand to 70%. Once I get ambidexterity, it'll be 100% I'll be using my offhand every attack. Um, so that's pretty good. Don't necessarily need butchery now. But there's lots of other things I can do. Like, I should probably get Juke. Let's get Juke. Now that I've got Juke, I can get a few other abilities that are quite nice. Uh, I don't have Bloodletter yet, but free attack? Yeah. Cool. So now if I want to, I can go AG, bam, you just got smacked, but you didn't. Or maybe he did, who knows, he died so quickly. At a remote in Darkukish, Yapater II, a thing that evoked the presence of an orbital miniature clock. Uh, my brain just completely collapsed in on itself. I'm gonna, at a remote, which is just a thing, I guess, in Darukukish. Yapater Avat, so Yapater the second is Avat, evoked the presence of an orbital miniature clock. She named it Clock's Beloved. That's just totally, your writing needs help. Is my game dying? Like, is that normal? Okay, come on, come on. I'm gonna shotgun you, then I'm gonna reload. I'm gonna shotgun you in the face again. I hope you enjoy being shotgunned. Anytime you can come and see me, I will plug you in the face with a shotgun, 100%. This is not for real people. If you're a real person, you come and see me. I'll just call the police because unless I invited you, like, you should know better. That being said, I'm not popular enough that anyone's coming to see me, so probably actually I'd be like, oh, wow, weird. Um, okay, doke. Ah, hey, dude. Let's uh, paralyze you. And then we could 
I'm thinking shoot you with a shotgun. That that worked well. Take all that. What was it a couple water skins and some assorted crap? Okie doke. You die. Ooh, nice. Oh, didn't even realize all you guys were coming in there. I was moving a bit too fast, and I happened to accidentally murder a bunch of snap jaws because they're so fragile. Oh, okay. Well, I will reload, but that's not what I meant to do anyway. I am. Okay. Oh, hey, Archer, dude. Take that mace. And anything here I want? I want your arrows. Uh, I'm going to have to consider looking at the time. Apologies, I, I don't know how to set it up so that the music doesn't cut out when I alt-tab out. So, okay, yeah. We are out of time for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'm going to leave it here. I hope you did enjoy the episode. If you did, hit the, uh, the, the thumb up thing. If you didn't, then just go away quietly. Don't make a, Don't make a scene. Okay, don't make a scene. Thank you. And either way, take care of yourselves. Have a good day. Take care of each other. Be well. And you will hear me when you hear me. <laughs>